Okay, so there is just so much new today, including the new monster as well as whatever this is. So I'm gonna go ahead and watch it. Hello and welcome to Sea of Thieves News. There's lots to get through today, so hold tight to that wheel and let's set sail in the direction of news. Hmm. Glorious news. If you were watching the Xbox and Bethesda showcase, you might have spotted Which us announcing that Season 7 is launching on the 21st of July, yeah. and in full-blown musical fashion, I might add. You'll be able to become the captain of your own ship, which means you can give it a name, gain access to deeper levels of customization, save your ship's loadout between sessions, and gain access to quick cash-in points at each outpost. There is, of course, more to reveal about Season 7 and what it means to be a captain, but that'll have to wait until a little closer to release. So keep your eyes on our social channels for more about Season 7 in July. We've also released the Captains of Adventure song onto your favourite music services, so if you want to sing along while you wait for Season 7, you can listen to it now. And available now on the Rare Store are three new t-shirt designs which pay tribute to the mystery surrounding the apparent demise of a once glorious sea dog. It's the perfect get-up for sleuthing as you work to uncover the culprit behind this heinous act. Personally, I've got my suspicions about Joni, but those existed long before someone did into Marco, so we'll see. On the 23rd of June, we'll be releasing all new items into the Pirate Emporium, and there's plenty to dig into. The prehistoric Plunderer ship set has emerged from the depths of time, bringing the majesty of prehistory to the seas. With accents of gold and amber and fossilized fish bones, this stunning ship set looks like it could have been excavated from a dig site. With the prehistoric Plunderer weapon bundle bringing it. Well, I don't know how I want to feel about this. I, if, judging from my name, you all know I love dinosaurs. So I am well aware of what fossils and amber is. And the they're adding an entire ship set dedicated to it. Extinction level event upon your enemies as they feel the bite of beasts from a land before time. And to complete the look of pirate paleontologist, the prehistoric plunderer costume is just the thing you'll need to ensure that every dig unearths only the finest treasures. And it's time to get physical with the new Sports Day emotes. This selection of athletic emotes are sure to get your pulse racing. Just don't forget to warm up properly. And there's also the Stage Dive emote bundle. Part stealth, part dramatic posing, part intimidating aggression. This emote bundle has plenty of outrageous poses to choose from. And you can also get a free emote too. The rant and rave emote is the perfect petulant display for those moments when things just don't seem fair. And as the aftermath of your decision to save Golden Sands ripples throughout the seas, we are now ready to look ahead to our next adventure, and I'm excited to announce some new details. Our next adventure is called The Forsaken Hunter, uh -huh. and you'll be able to play it next week on June 30th. Okay. So keep an eye on our social channels for the reveal of The Forsaken Hunter cinematic trailer on Monday the 27th. So, and you want to stay up to date with uh, Okay, that's all. Okay. Let's go back to the Amber stuff. Like, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is exciting for me. All right, let, let's take a good the look at this ship. The prehistoric plunderer ship set has emerged from the depths of time, breaking the... Look at that beauty! Oh my gosh! That, I, well, I... <laughs> this is one of the best ship sets I've ever seen. And I may or may not be vouching for it for the simplest reason that I love fossils. This is a perfect ship set for me. I'm gonna be rocking that figurehead, that's for sure. That's a sick freaking figurehead. Oh my gosh. Man. Also, the sails look just awesome. I mean, I'm really excited for these tomorrow now. I want that figurehead and sails. I don't care about the hole or anything else. I just want the figurehead and darn sails. Like, that all looks amazing. This... 
I am so glad I started playing Sea of Thieves. Sea of Thieves is slowly becoming my favorite game of all time. Just because of this. I'm I'm glad I'm rich on ancient coins. <laughs> and I'm glad I just don't go willy nilly wasting them. My god, that is a beautiful ship set. Majesty of I want that to the sea with, the with accents of gold and amber. Me and the anchor too. Like this and fossilized fish. Look at that! Just this look. Oh my god! Stunning ship set. Looks like it could have been. I am flabbergasted. <laughs> I I have no words for this. Like, this is the coolest thing I've ever seen in a video game. I've never seen a game mention paleontology during the time that I'm playing the game. I chose to start playing at the best time ever because I bet you when this thing is gone out of the Pirate Emporium, you'll never be able to get it again. Oh my god, that thing is beautiful. Like, it's fossils... I own a few fossils of my own. Excavated from a dig site. My With God. With a prehistoric plunderer weapon bundle. Bring in like, look at those guns. The blunderbuss looks real cool. I love the sword, the pistol, and the sniper. I'm so getting that sniper. Extinction level event upon yeah, I'm definitely getting the sniper. Honestly, Your enemies, as they feel this the is my favorite from a set ever. Time. And to complete the look of pirate paleont- look, Just look at that. I, want, I hope this isn't a costume and I hope it's all in separate pieces. Because I want that peg leg. A peg leg is just- Apologist, the prehistoric plunderer costume is just the thing you'll need to ensure that every deck unearths only the finest treasures. And no, it's, it's time to get physic- Okay. My gosh, that's, 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 that, I, I just can't get over the figurehead. I can't get over the darn figurehead. That just looks so cool. Just amber. A fossil encased in amber. It's just so cool in my opinion. And then we go to the actual entire thing. That's a glorious ship set if I've ever seen one. This ship set fits me so well. For the simplest reason, I love dinosaurs, I love paleontology, and I own myself a few fossils. I even have an ammonite fossil, which is what's on the sale right there. This is... I'm about to cry. <laughs> this is just the best ever. I wonder what the, uh... What is it called? Um... I forgot the I believe it's called like the exotic figurehead or something like that exotic oh no collector I I wonder what the collector will look like unless if the normal ones just without amber if it's without amber I'm gonna get it over the actual one more than likely because I like just having the bones and not the amber but if the sales are just like the dinosaur claw, I'm definitely getting the sales if it's the normal one. I'm excited for this tomorrow now. I'm really, really excited. I want this so bad. Just look at that beauty. Sorry that I'm just ranting on about just this, but never in my entire life would I ever think that... Rare would add something paleontology related. Like, this is just amazing. First, the new monster in my singing monsters today, and now this was revealed today. Like, I'm so gonna rant on all about this today. <laughs> and I'm excited to play Sea of Thieves even more now. I'm just not realizing it's going to be so hard for me to fall asleep tonight. <laughs> Let's hope I fall asleep like last night, falling asleep at 10 o'clock, waking up at... What? Like, what time is it? Yeah, about 7.30 I'd say I woke up. Man. This is just a beautiful darn ship set. Like, look at it. 
yellow with a bit of blue because of the eye. That is just amazing. I'm so getting this ship set. Not the whole thing, but only the parts I actually want, like the sails and the figurehead. And maybe even the cannons. Hold on, wait, I didn't really get to see the cannons. Prehistory to the seas, with accents of you know what? Never mind on the cannons. Cannons are pretty cool, but just not my taste. More than likely, the darn anchor. That's pretty cool. Like, this just, stunning ship set looks like it could have been excavated. Just look at that darn figurehead. My god. That is... I'm getting so many dinosaur vibes from this. But yet, I know it's probably like a prehistoric shark. Knowing Sea of Thieves, at least. But still, that is amazing.